What's up ladies? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. I'm your girl Lorna Marie and today for you we're doing an organization video but we're going to do my health cabinet organization which I know sounds really weird. It's not my medicine cabinet, it's my health cabinet. This has got all of my shakes, my proteins, my smoothie stuff, uh, water flavoring stuff, zero calorie sweeteners, sauces and all that good stuff in one place because I don't know if you know this, but I'm a mom of four and I have been, it's just been a struggle. The fourth baby, it's like, oh, and then I live in San Diego and there's just delicious food everywhere. So, but I've been doing really, really good and this cabinet helps me stay on track. So I thought this would be a fun, unique, interesting video to show you guys, but also show you guys some organization at the same time. So we get the systems that I got going on and the organization all into one video. How do you like that? <laughs> so if you're into this thing, definitely consider subscribing and hitting that little bell so you're notified. I do a lot of lifestyle, mommy, organization videos. I've been doing a lot of travel videos and all that good stuff, but I thought I'd keep it grounded this video, get back to my roots and show you guys some organization videos because I really, really do enjoy it. Now I'm gonna list everything down for you guys in the down bar, like my website. Now I have my Amazon influencer link where you can find all of my Amazon favorites down there. So all of that stuff will be there. Past videos, all the product links. Girl, I got your back. I literally use like the whole thing. It says, sorry, you cannot type anymore. That's how I like to do it. I like to give you guys as much information as possible because that's what I like to see in those down bars. So also come say hello. I've been loving getting to know you guys. Like I could literally list people that I remember that I feel like are my friends. I don't know if that's weird, but I feel like you guys are my internet friends because all you do is really talk, text your friends anymore anyway. So now I feel like I have this other outlet of texting or communicating with people. And I just love getting to know you guys. Like I really feel like I'm creating some friendships. I'm asking about people's moms and we're going back and forth about our travel plans and all that good stuff. And some of you literally comment every single video don't think I don't notice because I totally do so question of the day is let me know down below what your favorite way to store your health products do you guys have a cabinet do you guys have a different type of system a drawer a shelf let me know in the comments below we'd love to share and get some info on what you guys like to do stay tuned for the end of the video for my secret emoji and that lets me know that you guys watch my video all the way through and it just means so much to me. Now, if you are a ride or die or you're new and you guys enjoy my content, give your girl a thumbs up, deposit that positive energies because girl, it's gonna come back to you. I promise it will. I so appreciate it when you guys thumbs up and share my video, it means the world to me. So without further ado, if you guys wanna see what's inside my health cabinet and you guys wanna see me redo the whole thing because I just had some a spark of inspiration to redo it because it's kind of a hot mess right now. So we will be going through that whole process. So if you wanna see that and you wanna get some inspiration for your own kitchen, then just keep watching. The first thing we're gonna do is pull everything out of this cabinet because it is kind of crazy right now. But I just start putting everything into piles, sorting everything, getting rid of stuff, throwing stuff in the garbage, and making sure I'm not putting anything back in this cabinet that I don't want. Then I'm gonna pull out these nasty, ugly liners that are in here. They were gross and from the previous people that lived here. So we are ripping these out. And then we are gonna spray everything down and make it look fresh and clean. And then of course, you know your girl has to come in with some labels because that just makes my day when I label everything. So I print everything out, get it ready to go, cut it all up, and then I start sticking it on here. My husband's like, you're not measuring your stuff. And I'm like, no, I'm pretty good. I just, I just go for it, you know what I mean? <laughs> so I stick all the labels on here and make sure everybody knows where everything goes. I wanted to give you guys a little tour first and show you guys what I have. We're gonna start on the top shelf here. Now, this is my overstock. Basically, everything that I have extras of, I fill all my containers down below of everything that is on this top shelf. Now, this is my organic peanut butter, powdered peanut butter I put in my protein shakes. I always have vanilla and chocolate, which the chocolate is behind here. I have an extra one. And when it runs out of here, I will refill it, okay? from this and when it's empty, I know, okay, I need to repurchase another one because I always like to have at least one backup on hand. Now, this is my collagen, this is amazing. I make matcha and I always show you guys on Instagram, so definitely follow me there if you guys are interested in seeing how I make it. But I add collagen to it and matcha is so good for you, it boosts your metabolism. Collagen's great for your hair, skin and nails. Now I got this, this is 
a good source of fiber and it's xylem, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, I'm not gonna try, but it's fiber and you can add it to honestly water or your oatmeal or protein shakes, whatever you wanna do to add some extra healthy fiber for your heart. Then we have this spirulina, which I absolutely love this stuff, and I put this in my green smoothies. Now, this stuff makes green smoothies just taste so much better to me, and it adds protein, and it's all vegan, and it has no like whey or anything like that, so I love putting it in my green smoothies. Now this is my holy grail. I'm obsessed with this. I always put this in my protein shakes on top of fruit, all kinds of stuff and it is just so good you guys I highly suggest it it's a little pricey but I feel like the investment for your health is so worth it now I found these packets of the same thing and they're called like refills but they're actually cheaper so I would just go ahead and buy these so good then over here I have this is called Soleil solution I'll link the book that I've read down below but I mean it has healing properties it helps um, you add it to this little nasal pot here to clean out your sinuses naturally. I mean, there's so many benefits. You could add it to your bath. You can drink it every day, and it's supposed to lower blood pressure or raise blood pressure. It does all kinds of things for your body. It's natural sodium, and you make a Soleil solution. But I could get into a whole video about that. But anyways, I keep that up here. And like I said, this is all of my back stock. We have our smoothie protein. Now, what happens is, see how it's low? I would grab this smoothie protein and add it here. And then I would have an empty space up here so I would know, okay, now I need to refill this one. So I'm getting ready to do that. Next up, we have our chocolate protein, our peanut butter powder, and our vanilla protein. And I basically pull from here to use them. And I always keep, see there's a scoop right here. I always keep a scoop in each one. Every time I get a new thing, I always make sure each one has a scooper. I even stole the scooper for one of, um, for my smoothie ones. Okay. Then over here, I've shown this also on Instagram. Every week I like to pre-make matcha and I put it in these containers. I got these off of Daiso, so it's gonna be really hard for me to find these for you guys. I have one made, see right there. But I have one left, I gotta make them because I drink matcha every single day. But I put my collagen and my matcha and everything ready to go. So I just dump it in, add my sweetener and a little bit of creamer and we're good to go. And I also do that for my protein because I add each one of these one scoop into my protein that's just how i like it to taste and then i put it ugh, i'm so mad because my kids wash it i cannot find it but it's like a little tower and i put each serving basically of my protein in each one of these and i prep it for the week so there's like six containers of this but it's not prepped and ready to go i just want to show you guys that i'll try to insert a picture so you can see what it looks like so now we have a uh, chlorella you add this to water and it is so good for you. I'll try to list the benefits here for you or down below. And then up here I have, this is sugar-free powdered creamer. I like to add this to my matcha if I'm out of the regular kind from the fridge. One more thing I forgot to show you guys. This is Diet Snapple and Crystal Light individual packs. Now these are unnatural artificial sweetener. I know that they're not that good for you, but if I need something, like this, like something super sweet to drink, I will totally do it if it's an emergency situation. I don't do it all the time, like I prefer stevia and you know, natural sweeteners like honey and all that good stuff, but I will, I will, girl. I'll do it if I have to. <laughs> and then it just goes in the back of these two guys right here. Coming down to this here, this is all of our vitamins, mine and my husband's, and this is what I use. Let me pull this out. It actually comes with um, both of these. Now, this is what it looks like. I fill them up every week, and then I take one out and use it for the day, and then we just stick them right back in here with our vitamins. Now, we did have this in a drawer, so this is a little bit of a newer system, but my husband requested that we you know, can see them so he can be reminded to use them every day. But here's the extra collagen, and a tip that I like to do is I go to the dollar store, and I love to buy extra like tablespoons or whatever so I know what the serving is, and I separate them, and I put one little scoop in there so I can just no, okay, one tablespoon is a serving. And if I don't, I'll even write it with like a label and I'll put what the serving size is. So it makes it so nice. Then back here, I have my matcha. 
And usually I have it made, like I said, in these guys, but if it's not made, I just pull these bins out and I'm ready to go. Now in here, this is all of my, this is my, my favorite bin because it's all of my sweetener. And I have Better Stevia here, which is a sweetener I always add to matcha, to smoothies, to shakes, to sweeten it up. I already showed you guys this is what's open right now is that um, chocolate syrup. I put this on top of apples, strawberries, whatever. It's just so good. This is another syrup. I have, and I'm gonna be showing you guys really soon my um, health bag, it's very related to this, but I have a lot of these things that I like to take on the go. And then that's another big one of that sweetener here. And this is one, wait, so this is the same brand, um, but it's the vanilla syrup. So you can put this in your oatmeal or whatever. I just like to have a variety of sweeteners that are zero calorie, love this stuff. Okay, next up we have all of my blender cups. Now I really like this cup for matcha because I put the lid on it after I blend it up and then it keeps it hot. I hate when my stuff gets cooled off. So that's a good way you can just keep pouring it into your mug. I love doing this. And then I just have my regular one back here. So if I wanna make a protein shake or whatever, I can use a protein one in here, but I don't prefer this one for the frozen stuff because it just, I feel like it gets too cold and it gets too thick. I like mine so I can drink it. And then I keep my blender in here. I like my counters to be empty. So I just keep my blender in here and I always keep the blade inside, I rinse it as soon as I'm done using it and I stick it right back here so it's ready to go. Now in the back here, I just have shaker cups. So if we need to mix, you know, my husband needs to do pre-workout or we need to take a protein shake on the go or whatever, I have these in the back to use. This is my absolute favorite part, putting all the puzzle pieces together, just like Tetris, making sure everything fits like a glove. Now you guys know this top shelf is all of my overstock, everything that I need to make sure I have on hand as backups. And then also my soleil and my nasal thing. Well, it's for my husband and my son. They have like really bad allergies. If you guys don't know about the neti pot, definitely get one. And then here's all on my shake and smoothie powders. Those all go on one shelf in these big aqua so containers which I absolutely love to use these they're super easy to use and then I have my creamers and other stuff that I showed you guys my vitamins and then also we have right next to it um, the matcha stuff we got the stuff that goes inside the matcha we got my sweeteners we have um, the blender cups the shakers and the blender but I just love the way it turned out I hope you guys enjoyed it because I think it looks so beautiful and so easy all right you guys I hope you enjoyed my health cabinet organization video I love being able to show you guys videos like this because it has my system and organization all in one video and I just really enjoy showing you things you might be able to use in your house now if you think you could use anything or you enjoyed this video give your girl a thumbs up I'd so appreciate it like I said I got your back girl I'm gonna list everything I can find for you guys in the down bar including my website and all my favorites for amazon in my amazon influencer link now don't forget to answer that question of the day what do you guys do for your system for your health products is it all in one cabinet a drawer a, what what do you guys like to do let us know in the down bar below and if you've made it all the way to the end of this video give me an apple emoji and let me know that you did it means so much to me thank you guys because really when you guys even just do one little apple it just really boosts my channel and it shows that people are watching it. So thank you guys so much. I truly appreciate it. And until next time, I'm always your girl, Lorna Marie.